Hey guys, I want to thank all of you that supported The Smoking Tire by buying some of our merch during our limited run sales. But so many of you have emailed me in between then saying they want to get merch. We couldn't help but open a store. So we did it with something old and something new. We brought back the vintage tee and vintage hoodie in all the colors, so now you can get those again. And we got Smoking Tire embroidered hats. They're dope. We got the Curved Bill New Era Flex Fit in all sizes, and we got the Flat Bill Snapback for you. So go to our store. It's in the description of the video, or click the annotation. Get one for yourself, and of course, thank you for supporting the Smoking Tire. Hey guys, welcome to the Angeles Forest. Um, I love... NA Civic Builds. I think you've seen my joy at three or four of them by now. And this is going to be it. We're going to stop here. <laughs> as far as I know, we've reached the end of the NA Civic Build line uh, <laughs> with Emmanuel from NA Performance. And good to have you, sir. Uh, you may remember Emmanuel. Um, he rode with me in that white supercharged uh, Civic that you built. Mm -hmm. He also built the red NA Civic, uh, George's car that I loved. This is your personal car. Yes. Tell me about it. So it's a 2007 8th generation Civic. The All the other Civics you drove were 9 gen, so mm -hmm. this is the older model. Um, this has a K25, which is a TSX bottom end, sleeved, overboard, and it's got a CNC head, uh, cams, drag cartel cams, the valve train. It's got a custom manifold, custom throttle body, and most importantly, it's got a MoTeC ECU. Okay, and... <laughs> Uh, you said 330 wheel horsepower. Yes, NA. 330, and there is a dyno sheet. I'm sure there so. is. Well, you're, I mean, you're sell, You know, this you're you're the guy here. So, uh, I, I, and I've driven your uh, two of your other cars now, and I have no doubt this is going to kick ass. So let's uh, let's have a go. And this is running E85. Yes. Yep. Oh, okay. <laughs> So you said uh, before we got in the car, this is 14 to 1 compression? Yes, 14 to 1. So how far, I mean, how far down the rabbit hole is this? Is this, is this the end of the line for this? I think this is the end of the line for a street car. This um, is as crazy as you could build This is as road. far as I'll go for a street setup. Okay. Yeah, if I go any further, I won't drive it on the street. Road's a little damp. And you said you drag race this car from time to time. Right? Yes. Yeah, we just got back from the drag strip and it went 11.3 at 124. In case you didn't hear that, let me repeat. 11.3 at 124 in an all-motor Civic street car. Yep. That's kick-ass. That, I assume, is slicks on the front, yes, right? Yes, slicks. Uh, and we took out the seats. But that's about it. <laughs> I haven't gone more than like half throttle yet because the road is kind yeah. of damp, but... The tech is also Sorry. very high. The uh, the pedal space... You have to really stab it. You do have to stab it. Yeah, to, for the downshift okay. you have to really stab it. There we go. I had to turn my foot and actually use my heel and my toe as opposed to side to side. Where is VTEC? Uh, 6800. Oh wow, it's, it's up, up there. there. Yeah. Oh, this thing is manic, though. Yeah. It wants it wants you to be mean to it. Oh yeah. <laughs> wow, it feels great. So much like instant power. You know, here's the difference between these NA cars and the turbo cars. I can feel the power when I'm not on the throttle. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I'm off throttle and I still can tell that it's there. The shifter is so good. Thank you. It's Transmission's all done. There's, oh yeah, you have yeah. custom gearing in this car yes, too, right? Yeah. So how do you? Oh my God, this is so good, bro. <laughs> how do you? How did you change the gearing? Uh, so we did PPG uh, helical first and seconds, uh, third gear stock, fourth and fifth are from an uh, Integra Type R from Japan, and sixth gear is uh, from a 2012 Civic because it's the tallest one, and the final drives off the Type R. Okay, yeah. so but that that's a whole big, big hodgepodge of mix and match. Yeah. How did you come up with that? I just kind of looked at the ratios and kind of. 
kind of saw what I needed for the car. Okay. And uh, I mean, even with this short gearbox, we're going through all five gears in the quarter mile. So we have to really. So you're running 11 seconds, shifting four times. In the yes, four times now.
sit behind a Dodge Dart. And so I'm going to stop right here, and we are going to give us an opportunity to at least finish this video off strong by going a little bit quick at the end. Because this car, oh yeah, see the idle's rough. Yeah. Listen to that. <laughs> it's just, it's, just, it's a cam, cammed motor. Do you have like yeah. solid motor mounts and that kind of stuff too? Or is that I actually, just the motor? For this shoot, I put one of the stock mounts back in just, <laughs> just, just to, to kind of it calm better. it down. Yeah. Yeah, it's brutal. Yeah. All right, we're gonna, we've made ourselves a little gap. I, I commend your use of a pretty normal clutch though. Yeah, it's an Exeti Stage 1. They don't, you don't need a crazy clutch on this, huh? No. Shooting for tens. The 60 foot was horrible on that run. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, so. you got to be uh, busy to that insight. He ran nines. <laughs> but that's like, yeah. that looks like one of those like solar cars. Yeah. It's like it's got like little bicycle tires. Yeah, on this, it this has an actual intake and an exhaust. Yeah, it's this, a street car. Yeah, it's a street car. That's so. crazy. Well, uh, and check out Emmanuel's wheel well. I, I'd like to see the, the, the real detailed parts list of this. That's some cool, nerdy stuff. Thank you for watching. Yep. Thank you for coming cool. down, sir. I really right. appreciate it. Have a good afternoon.